If you're in the middle of setting up a Windows 11 laptop or desktop computer and it's trying to force you to join a network and create a Microsoft account and enter an email address and all that, but you'd rather not do that, I'll show you a latest trick that works as of today, early June 2025. So to do this, I have a brand new Lenovo Yoga laptop that I bought for a customer of mine. This is about a $1,300, $1,400 machine and we're going to go through the first boot up process right now. So here I'm going to literally connect a HDMI cable and on this model you have to have it in wall power the first boot. So this has never been turned on before and as you can see, oh yeah it even has the keyboard protector and everything. So we'll go ahead and hit the power button and we should just see exactly what happens when it turns on. So here we go. All right, here's the Windows Setup program starting, and there's a few questions it'll ask, and then I'll show you the trick in just a second. So we'll agree to the country, and yes to that one. Uh, skip to the keyboard secondary. And here it is, so let's connect you to a network. So you'll see there's no way to get around this, and it's real annoying. Uh, so here's the magic trick, on your keyboard, now if it's a desktop computer, you wanna hold your shift key and push the F10 key, that's function key 10 on the top row of your keyboard. Now if you're on a laptop, sometimes if that doesn't work, you have to hold another button to activate the function keys on your keyboard. So in that case, like on this computer, it would be shift, FN F10. So I'll hold shift FN and then hit F10. Now that makes the command prompt window appear just like this. Um, often you have to actually click once with the mouse or the touchpad in the black box. And once you've done that, here's the magic trick. Um, type in exactly what I list here. So it's the word start and then hit the space bar and then MS dash CXH colon and then the words local only all is one word, no spaces. So the only space you're doing is after the word start. And then just hit enter, and that's my trick. So this window appears, and what this is for is it'll just stop the setup process right where it's at and allow you to create a local Windows 11 account, and it'll just bypass the network requirement and the Microsoft account requirement and everything. So what I'm gonna do is just enter um, Something in here will just say user. Now, if I don't put a password, I won't be forced to create the challenge questions and it takes a long time. So uh, just type in whatever username you'd like to use, click next. And I'm gonna just go through this and accept defaults. Now you can go through and pick and choose each one. Uh, looks like it wasn't too bad. So, and as you can see, it jumped right to the high screen, getting things ready. So this is great. Uh, so when you're all done with the Windows setup process, this is what normally shows up. And I'll fast forward a little bit and it should jump right to the desktop screen and you're done. No network, no Microsoft account, and you can do as you wish with the computer and not be forced to do as Microsoft wanted you to. So here's a few more questions. I'll just skip through, accept. And there we go, we're on the Windows desktop, so we didn't get stuck having to go through all that. So if you found this video helpful, please consider giving the video a like and subscribe to my channel to keep up with my latest. Also, I have a lot of other tech and how-to Windows videos on the channel that you might find interesting, so feel free to check them out. Thank you so much for your time and have an awesome rest of your day.